La la. Right. Where we had a patient. Right. What's going on? How are you not know? Come on. Come on. Uh, Frank Husky. Go for treatment. Um. Okay, that's all right. We're coming to the top of Gilbert the hour, Catnip. Which, if you ask me, <laughs> is the very best part of the hour. I know, I know. You always place the beds say, first, Richie, and then realize you don't have. The of the I place to put plants and in that down, yeah. Ah, <laughs> uh, you have to put the clock wall up for attractiveness. Unlock the dog best painting. Passing. Oh no, damn! Missed him. He was running to the toilet. Missed him. You. Top of that queue. We just want we just want to get to one star and then get out of here, right? That's what we want to do. Just because I don't really want to play this level, I've played it a lot. I have played it a lot. Should we unlock the dog painting? Do I have the dog painting? I do. Oh, the creme de la creme of dog paintings. There we, there we go. Nope. I can't afford it. Jesus. Jesus, everybody. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> no, you can't be trained. Oh my god, minus 10 rep. Well, it'll make less people come here. Let's uh, sell that. <sighs> if we could just get more patients out for treatment, that would help with the money. 78. We could take, we could take a, a risk on it. Oh, look! I'm happy with your diagnosis level. Yes, I am. Quick, go for treatment. Oh my god. Let's see Eric Bonoffi, everybody. Let's keep an eye on Eric Bonoffi. He's our man. He's going to get us that one star so that we can run away and go to tumble. Yeah! Um, excellent. Patients are not permitted to sleep in ward beds. Oh. They do keep their eyes open. So, you know, it is a thing. It is actually a thing. <laughs> I love this thing. The, and the sound of this stuff being squirted on, isn't it amazing? Get their RGB. Everybody needs their RGB. Looking good. Looking good, Eric. Eric is our saviour. <gasps> the Encyclopedia Bookcase 1! Oh, is that on the wiki? Is that, is that <laughs> Can we just check if on um, on the uh, fandom wiki that uh, I've made, there's a link for it down below. Um, if at one star on the um, Mitten University page, it is there, there's hospitals, they're all listed, um, are these there as the unlock for one star? That hosp that encyclopedia bookcase? Oh yes. So pleased with that. That is amazing. And I know, I think, I say I know, I think at two or three stars you also unlock like the supercomputer for the research room, which I would love to do. But what I'd love to do more is get out of here. Oh brilliant! So we can play tumble. Oh, you need to get a star in Mitten and Tumble to unlock Flemington. Fine. Fine, let's do it. Now, I did play a lot of Tumble. So, <laughs> will I stick around in Tumble or just get one star and move on? Might might just get one star and move on. We've got the Fracture Ward. <gasps> the Fracture Ward. And then we might just go to Flemington, a level I have never actually played before. And that's where I will uh, start calming down and stop trying to skip stuff. Um, it's cold here still. Yes, it is. Yes, yes, it is. Okay. I quite like the the um, the design of um, this map as well. Quite like this. Um, you can get a good. You could get a really good patient flow going here if you really think about what you're doing. You know, the uh, the reception, your first step diagnosis. Um, and 
then your further diagnosis, then your next GP visit, then your cures, intermixed with your facilities, your staff rooms and stuff like that. Put your training rooms proper out of the way and your research rooms. Don't need those nearby. And, yeah, and get your toilets dotted about. Oh, so it's a good, it's really good for patient flow, this one. It's really, it's really quite nice. It's quite nice. It's very nice. Very nice. It's on the wiki. Thank you, Brody. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> um, thank you, Ira Mashi, for the follow. Why weren't you following? Aren't you a mod? <laughs> the hell right okay <laughs> i knew a mod for this channel <laughs> some outrage goddamn outrage um right i don't think i want the reception room it's a bit of a pokey area so we'll go to we'll get the reception item but you know i might actually stick it all the way back so there's plenty of room for queues and nobody goes outside. Oh my god, as soon as that reception goes down. Jeez. Give me a break. Oh, oh that's good. Double jump. Right. Uh. Ooh, 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 ooh. Littera. Ooh, 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 ooh. This is not what you shouldn't do, what I'm doing right now. Unhygienic. Not happening. Ursula. You're in. Janitors. Ooh, ooh. Patients should leave the hospital before they catch something else. I gotta be honest. Just mass hiring staff like that is probably not the best idea. Um, right, so we could do with... I want some instant heat. What? Probably. And um, that's actually quite warm. It's getting quite warm here. But, um... The thing is... Oh, and then the, these radiators now, these plants are now right next to radiators, which means they'll dry out faster. So, I'm doing well. <laughs> I'm doing well, everybody. <laughs> okay. All right. So, we need a GP. We need a GP. Um, also, if you are playing Two Point Hospital and you would like some buddies to um, have on your... All the family. Um, yes. Come to Grockle Bay Zoo. Uh, what am I trying to say? And Over. see stunt monkeys. On your leaderboards and that in-game. Then join the Discord. Link is in the description below. We're sharing uh, game IDs, uh, Steam IDs in there. So that we can uh, join each other's games, see each other's leaderboards. Uh, do the online challenges together. Um, and we're just talking about Two Point Hostel in general. Lots. Um, game tips, we share each other's struggles so that we can help each other out, uh, we're sharing screenshots, um, useful links, all that stuff. You should uh, definitely come and join us, join us. Um, right, there we are, there's that, let's pop down Benny um, and also drinks machine and the taste of the sea right in your mouth with the salty snacks machine um and we will wash their hands at all times. boredom can be a factor here so pop that down we definitely need a big bin because we've got some rubbish machines kicking about and how about something pretty there it is right okay um he's definitely uh a our dude right now so the first thing we need is a ward what kind of ward just a normal ward okay how much money do we have what's going on probably not a lot how much is this one 30 i think we might open this sorry car park oh you can actually hear the bus and now you can hear them working in the area That's nice. Our strings, thank you so much for the follow. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I can hear them working away. Ah, I like it. Nine days left. Ward required. Humorous injury. This is the fracture ward. Fracture ward. Okay. Okay, everybody. Okay. 
but we could do let's just build some toilets while people are waiting hmm. build some toilets toilets uh, some small toilets these are my this is my small toilet design uh, oops uh, at the moment as it stands this is the design uh, plant right? big bin it's also shabby um, but we do need the personal best clock to go in the toilets as well that's become a thing now there we go dog painting oh, yes <laughs> Boom. look at that need the toilets Knock Any yourself out. Suspicious objects um, should be poked with the special stick. Jumbo Medical Solutions has introduced a wonderful this new feature built. in all the okay. hospitals. Right, they're coming in At thick and fast. Just pause it a minute. Bed or sit down. Patients can now order any jumbo product and have it flown in by drone directly really? to their room. Excellent. How's that for convenient. <laughs> a fracture ward. We're going to do it like this. Uh, do the plaster cast room. Let's get the traction beds. Pretty bulky. Okay. Bum, bum. Bum. Bum, bum, bum. Where's the screen? Why? Why? Do we not have a screen for this room? Okay. Still learning this room, look. Uh, Lala's still learning. It's weird, isn't it? <laughs> it's, it's weird. Okay. God damn it! <laughs> Do I have to have one? Okay. I want two dot. I want the two. There. Nice! Nice! Um, we will pop that in there. We don't have any radiators, people. It's probably going to be a bit nippy in here. We'll do that afterwards, actually. Um, although we could put a radiator there. There's no reason why we can't. Um, okay, let's uh, let's just build that second. Because then it's that. Because then we can edit this room, and then we can see like our attractiveness and that so yeah okay so let's put an attractiveness there I th this is the first time I've ever sort of played with this room properly I mean I know that Dr. Hayward, the I was messing around with it at Sega but it's it's difficult to explain there wasn't a lot of concentration going on it turns out it wasn't difficult to explain right okay so there we go it's a bit warmer a bit warmer Okay, Ooh, it's really warm in there now. Really warm in there. Sweat those fevers out. <laughs> That's what we're going to do. We're going to sweat these fevers out. Thank you for the bits, Charmed Vegan. Thank you so much. Uh, now I can see the overlays. Yeah. Yeah. You, to see the overlays in the room, you will need to build it and then edit it. Um, when you've got overlays on, I mean, you could put the overlay on when you're building. Um, but the room... Look, can look a little bit weird in build mode uh, in blueprints when you're blueprinting and in overlays. They could, they, I don't know. I don't like it. It's just a personal thing. It's, it's not for me. Um, so I'd rather just build and then edit the room. Okay, so what is this? Five patients. Not now. I really don't think we can do it. Uh, yeah, I, I'm on it. I'm on it. You want further diagnosis? Uh, for now, just go home on further diagnosis decisions. Um, yes, I'm going to be building a ward next. We've got this lady. We've got this lady. She is going to... Oh, although, you know, it is worth us building a pharmacy, I would say. Um, so she can concentrate on that. Uh, let's get a ward in as well. Excellent. Uh, 
really like the chopper, everybody. I really like the chopper. Okay. So if we just... It's, it's, can we, have we got a member staff that's with a bit of war training? Excellent. Nausea inducing, bit of a shame. With Ricky Hawthorne. <laughs> well, actually, I'm the one who's on the okay. air. You're just listening to me being on the air. Being on the air. the air. You're listening to the air. <laughs> listening to the air. Just trying to pick up a keyboard. Can you see that? Register your body. Compost like, this is, this has been glued to the desk. The grass be this has been from glued the other side. to the desk. Indeed it has. Should we unlock these? I like these. I like these. Just, just, just unlock this. Add something. It adds something. And then every bed needs a prem de la creme dog painting. Oops, I didn't mean to press that button. That was the speed keyboard button. Didn't mean to... Didn't, didn't mean to... No. Um, didn't mean to press it at all. <laughs> I think it's about time to cut my nails. It's getting quite long, people. Right. Um, now, it's cold out here. There's no kind of atmosphere. So we're just going to pop some radiators down here. Uh, we'll get some bennies. Extremely important. That's a particularly warm Benny. Look at that. Um, we'll get a bit of entertainment. Entertainment. Yeah. What I like about the wall beds, actually, talking about that, is this patient's mood is not great across the board, right? But when the nurse, she tends to the patients, and when she tends to them, these needs go up. She deals to their needs. She's quite literally doing it. Isn't that, isn't that brilliant? Isn't that brilliant? I like that. I like that. She even entertains them. She even increased their boredom. You're all alone, more or less. <laughs> brilliant. Brilliant. Right. Um... So this is pretty good. We could probably do with um, this with a bin. Excellent. Okay. Um, then we could do with uh, a pharmacy. I think pharmacy would be a really spiffing idea. Um, the pharmacy I'm going to pop over here. Bring, bring. This is a treatment. Yes, please, eventually leave. Put that there. Excellent. I do need to. I think now that this machine's just taking a bit more space, I do need to reevaluate my design. But I think while I am on a stream is not the time because I tell you it's hella boring <laughs> watching me do that so we won't be doing that um let's um some good pop advice a chair from down. George Bristles who sent in this quote if at first you fail be thankful that you have friends watching them fail too will make you <laughs> feel better what He's right you know <laughs> what I did not hear that right um Where's the water fountain? There it is. All right, just calm down, Blala. There it is. Right. And then outside here, get a Benny. Um, now, it's probably cold out here. Yes, it is. Oh, you can see, you can see that s sort of snowy cold air just blowing across. Nippy! Right. Um, we will pop down those. Now, what did we learn? I think that we learnt that with these machines people will buy the drinks um, I don't know if I'm ready to do this. I think we'll just do it. We'll, uh, 
with the drinks machine, we could go plus 10 and get away with it, if I recall. Uh, excellent. Right, we could do with a staff room. Actually, couldn't we? We could do with a staff room. Um, for now, we're going to squeeze the staff room in here because the, re the reason for that is because it should help just for now help staff in both areas get about so we'll, we'll put it there um, and then we'll give them the gubbins right so they get a burp and gubbins right um, we'll put in a radiator um, keep it clean people and plant or two or five um, <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, okay, do you know, I love the animation of this thing. I do not put this, these around my hospitals nearly enough, actually. It's an outrage. If we put it next to the radiator, do the sweets get all sticky? <laughs> put that there. Uh, uh oh, that didn't sound good. In the event of a fire, please run for your lives. Pandemic. 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 Could do pandemic. Um, let's see. Yes. Fractal ward. How many? Five. Yeah. Pan's lab. Yeah, I'm going to build that. Um, how, before I build that, you've got an emergency coming in, dear. Oh, Jesus. Jesus. Worry not. Worry not. Actually. But she's geared up in treatment. She's... Oh, great warning. oh that is no. Your medication. Oh no. Well, at least it's getting the emergency patients to this ward faster. <laughs> Bright side, people. They right. Said he was too old. They said he looked ridiculous. But what's good about that earthquake is that it's reminded me to perhaps reconsider what's a going on with my on his spandex. This summer, Janice's Roderick Cushion returns as Roderick Cushion. Spandex. In Perilous Spandex Five. Right. I would like two point studios basically a two point studios game right uh, where you have the radio stations and television radio. programs and make movies so it's like a big studio in that respect you know and you have all the stars Excellent. that come to work Expert. there and that Plants and you have to water. build the sets um, you know and and sort out your newscasters and oh my god I want that game make that game two point make that game that's the game we don't, we don't want a bloody theme park game, all right, people? If you keep asking for that, I'm going to get annoyed because we don't need that. We don't want that. We don't need it. No, we don't. What we need is a remake of the movies, but adding in television and a radio station with it as well. Oh, God. Right, anyway, I'm over it. So, well, I'm not over it. I'm just going to stop talking about it. So we're going to put the dog painting in here um, and a picture about the brain. Because they've got a pan stuck on it. Got a pan stuck on it. We'll give them a, a, a water fountain. And I'd like the staff member to be able to sit down and relax during idle times. Um, bit of an odd door placement because I want to put Benny there. Um, and I think I've messed it up. Oh, God, I have as well. How peculiar. I actually can't cope with it. I'm actually going to have to edit that. Wow. Okay. Don't uh, other patients. You don't know where they've been don't know where they've been so we'll put a door there excellent excellent and they won't that window won't give anything away at all in fact what we could do just to make sure that nobody's seeing stuff that window, wanted just on the ward. put that there and now we can get a Benny down hells yeah right um do we have I don't know. Oh, we're getting some. We're getting some better staff in now that um, because, of course, as your reputation and your levels improve, better staff will um, 
apply. Cries of Hatch Ward, we got one. Knock yourselves out, people. Have they gone on break? I think so. Um, they were interacting, I think. That was nice. That was nice. So what do we have in the way of staff? Um, what's, what, what are you saying here? What are you saying? Why do you prefer reception desk instead of reception room? Um, I actually prefer the reception room. But uh, it's a pretty small hospital. And um, so I, I, I feel that for this building, this is a better choice um, for the situation that we're dealing with. And the reception room is great. I love it, but it does require a fair amount of room, I feel. Um, so I tend to favor it when I've got the room, I guess. Um, so we've got one doctor, the GP. So we need another doctor for Pan's lab. So a doctor with treatment skills is of interest, like this one here, Bell Pong. <laughs> um, excellent, Bell. Stay in Pan's lab. Um, actually, if we do, I don't know if we'll get. Do we get? Do we get that illness here? I don't know. Do you know? I don't know. Not sure. Um, why? Oh my God, that's hardly any money. How are you surviving on that? I'm so sorry. So sorry. I'm a dreadful person. Although saying that, I could employ somebody better for that money. Look. But they're unmotivated. Okay, you keep your job for now. Keep your job for now. Yes, you do. Put a bin. No. In the way. <laughs> no. Um, You're listening to Nigel Bickleworth. On Two Point Radio. Nasty. But Forget all the nonsense you've heard so far. Okay. I am Nigel Bickleworth, and I'm here to restore civility to Two Point Radio. <laughs> civility. Get a level four cardiology. Not right now, mate. Not right now. Not right now. He's trying to talk to you. My God, I'm sorry about the receptionist. Jesus. Jesus. It's rude. It's rude. It's rude. Um, really impressed with this GP. Really impressed with this GP. He's fantastic. What's going on over there? What's this? Ah, a deluxe clinic. Yeah, do you know, we've got a doctor that can do that. Um, so get them to wait. Because I... Oh, nice. Because I'm sort of kitted out, really. Um, so this is quite easy for me. I've, I've got I've got the doctor and, and everything, people. Everything. Um, keep the doors fairly closed because I'm going to make him march sort of between the rooms. Um, that's probably not a great place. There probably there could end up being a room there, right? Actually, what we could do. I do like to get windows in rooms. You need windows in rooms that are important, but I, I agree that we do need to think about the placing a bit. So do that. Um, found report, ham sandwich, partially eaten. Partially eaten. Lovely. Um, I want some comforts for our staff member that's going to be kicking about in here. So, um, a chair. Lovely. Um, we'll keep them happy. Uh, some warmth might be nice. Oh, maybe the small radio would be nice. What we could do, I mean, maybe we just... I want the radiator. Excellent. Make it, they can deal with their thirst. Um, could put a coffee machine in here so that they start moving around faster, faster. Um, but I'm not into it. I don't want to. <laughs> so deal with that. We'll put a cupboard here. Um, yeah, I'll put a plant over here. Um, the deluxe poster that shows us exactly what's going on in there. 
exactly what's going on. Um, keep the time. Keep the time. Uh, we could put one of these in here because um, staff will eat from this. And it might help with their hunger needs just a little bit. It doesn't do much. I wonder what madness <laughs> Bungle Tech will dream up next. I read in the Two Point Squabbler they've managed to attach a human ear to a kettle. I know the victory <laughs> for the modern world, I'm sure. <laughs> okay. Okay. There we go. This is alright. This is alright. Um, bit of entertainment. I'm going this. Um, and with that entertainment, patients found abusing hospital facilities will henceforth be considered organ donors. Wow! Wow! <laughs> wow! Deluxe clinic calling doctor. Okay. Um, do I want to be in here? Yeah, all right. Get to a point where we could really consider actually some more toilets over here. We're getting quite far away from our other set of toilets. Um, you know. Yeah. Did you have a break recently? Is this why we've got a queue? Or are you just rubbish? No, you have had a break recently. Okay, well, that's fine. Um, further diagnosis. Do I want to do further diagnosis at this point in time? Am I happy with what's going on here? Uh, this is a decision. You have to think about these things. That was dark, Tannoy Lady. Yeah, it was, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. <laughs> it really, really was. Getting warm in this room, guys. It's getting warm in this room. Might have to pop a fan on. <laughs> oh, hello, Gary. Welcome. Thank you for joining us. I'm trying to make a very hard decision. <laughs> Do I want to build more diagno diagnosis rooms now, or not? That's what I'm trying to decide. Yes. Yes. Because if I remember, we have a nurse who's not doing a lot. Geared up towards treatment. She's geared up towards treatment. Not diagnosing. God damn it. Right, okay. Can we have we got a diagnosis nurse? No. Not really. Okay, well while we build a further diagnosis. <laughs> so what we'll do? Um We'll try this one. We'll go with this one. Do you um, sometimes wonder whether to say you and I or you and me? Congratulations, you are one of the many poorly educated lads <laughs> who make life unbearable. Okay. There is a very simple formula it's making me feel bad. to discover which form is the correct one, but I fear even that would be too complex for you poor souls. Let's pop that in there. If you smell something uh, suspicious, please fill form 37B. 37B. What's that in reference to? I don't know that reference. Yearly review imminent. It is imminent, but I'm not going to come out of... No. <laughs> no. Um, we could squeeze one of these in here. Excellent. Oh dear. Done this bad. What's happened here? What did, what did I done? Ah. Too close. I didn't know that. We have a VIP really? visiting the hospital. Okay. Good. Do we have a VIP visiting the hospital? Ah, oh, what? What? Where's my uncomfortably hard or hardly comfortable chair? <laughs> Put that in there. Um, could need a clock. Keep the time. Wow. I went a bit nuts in that room. Did you see that? Look, there's all sorts in that room. <laughs> right, do we have any better nurses? No, not yet. Let's get a bedding down um, for here. How cold is it in this area? Do we know? Do we know? Nurse it's pretty cold. Pretty cold. pretty cold. Oh, 
Okay. Okay. Really need a nurse. Oh, God, you're going to have to do it, but you're rubbish. You're unhygienic. I can't. I can't let this go. Maintenance announcement. Plants need water. He's awful. So, I mean, he's geared up for treatment in the ward more than anything. Um, I'm going to make him work in here. Not only that, but he's unhygienic. Did he just use that? He just... Did he just use that? That's unexpected. I'm going to be honest. That was unexpected. That was unexpected. Ooh. Oh, Homer teeth. Sorry. 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 Sorry about that. Excellent. Excellent. As GP goes, as GPs go, you're all right, you know. You're not too bad either. Excellent. Doctor to Pan's lab, please. Excellent. It's a bit of an unusual thing. That would be a terrible bathroom, wouldn't it? But it might have to be a terrible bathroom. I overheard two adolescents mocking a poster advertising this very radio station and yours truly. Yeah. And can you believe it? They didn't even know what radio was. I'll tell you what radio <laughs> is, you sultana-brained miscreants. Uh -oh. It is a delivery uh -oh. system for class and integrity. It is the home of the world's noblest profession. And it is the fastest growing medium among people with three-figure IQs. Next up, <laughs> some god awful jingles. Hey, we hear that bit of ceiling up in his office, themselves. please. That might be nice. Please, no, please, please, no. God damn it! Should we pop? Pop these in. in Pan's lab. Oh really? Is there something wrong with Pan's lab? Did the earthquake mess it up? Uh, where is it? Not too bad, actually. Let's go for an upgrade on that. Let's go for an upgrade. Right, so that doctor that we had, that I hired. What did I... Did I do anything? No. Okay. Maintenance needed in staff room. Do we have those? Oh yeah, there's one. Okay. What's wrong with you? Staff promotion. Uh, okay, we're not earning lots of money at the moment. Fracture ward, five. Yes, okay, so we need to go and look over the fracture ward. The fracture ward. So what we're gonna do, got an emergency coming in, dear. Got an emergency coming in. Um, how are you? Could be better. Maintenance announcement. Not horrific. Bins will become full. No queue. Which means you're doing a grand job. Doing a grand job. Um, you might be nice as a spare. Um, and by that, I mean we're going to make it so that you'll work on either ward. Um, and because she's now left, because what we need to do is just allow each ward to have an extra member of staff. And then... Yeah, she can float between the wards where sort of it's needed. Does that sound good? Blood Spartan. Hello, welcome. Welcome. Uh, what level is this? This is Tumble. This is Tumble. This is Tumble. Yep. Yarps. It's Tumble. Um, right, so we're starting to see a bit of build up of patience. If we could. A lot of the, fracture, the VIP fracture people have just arrived. So it is a diagnosis issue. Um, we're not diagnosing them fast enough. So this could be um, helping. What would help this probably is just increasing um, the GP. The GP skills a bit might help. But uh, get, getting them out has helped those cues. Just popping those out uh, is great. Let's just check the lowest health. <gasps> 
Jazz hands. Been called in though. He's going to be fine, everybody. Leroy Crumble is going to be fine. That was a close one, everybody. <laughs> um, Ned Deluxe here. Wow. I really like the coat, the moustache, the glasses, the whole get-up. Love it. Um, oh no, we've got monobrow in, in, the, in the gaff. Um, King for GP's office. Okay, hello. When I place two nurses in a ward, the second one uh, placed... Uh, always to place the first one. I saw on Two Point Stream that you can place as many nurses in a ward as you want, but mine keeps replacing the current nurse. Yeah, so that was it. That was it. Did you see it? Did you see it? So, to add more nurses, extra staff, and you can just. They go four. Extra. So why don't you listen to some music? So one, two, three, four, five in total. Yeah, it's just four extra. So I've put one extra. So I've done that on each. Um, so and because I've got one nurse that will only work this ward, I've got one nurse that will only work this ward, and then one nurse that will work either. So that optional can be picked up from her whenever, uh, whenever needed. Really, whenever needed. <sighs> Well, I think it's worth the price, personally. Uh, I have purchased two copies of this game and gifted them away. <laughs> um, so I clearly think it's worth it. Um, you know. What's going on here? Let's get all the, the VIPs are all at the top. How many nurses? They're doing it. I can finally see this thing being used. Uh, it is so fun. It's so fun. I love this game so much. I just want to play it all the time. <laughs> it's me, Lindsay. It's me, Lindsay. Hello, it's me, Lindsay. Uh, Void Scorpion, thank you so much for the follow. And uh, the real, the, the real Fandango. Fantastic. Thank you for the follow. Love it. And it's me, Lindsay. Thank you for the follow. Yes, Excellent. The Definitely worth it. Yes. And uh, currently still 10% discount. Yes, if you go and buy it on Steam up until the 5th of September, uh, it is on discount by 10%. Indeed it is. Um, and you can get the golden toilet, which we're not really taking advantage of at the moment um, because I haven't really advanced enough hospitals for that sort of nonsense. Right. <laughs> Um, what is this? Our patient, Ned Deluxe, has been sent to all the diagnosis rooms. He's going to have to go home. Um, promote. Yeah, we really do need to look at staff training. It's becoming a major issue, actually. Um, it's becoming an issue. What we could do... Uh, I don't know. Do I want to do this? Do I want to do this? So what I'm thinking about is patient flow. I could move treatment clinics to here and put training facilities in here which can be out of the way, research facilities which can be out of the way. Is this an indication where the doors are going to be? Let's build it. Let's just do it. Let's just do it. I uh, still don't know how to get my toilet in game and did all stuff. Okay, when you say did all stuff, have you watched my video on my channel? Um, I made a one minute video um, that will fix it. Um, so I recommend going to watch that. It's helped loads of people out. Um, so do that. Uh, give that a go now because you can claim it right now if you go and do it. But you have to do exactly what the video says. Uh, you know, um, if you if you skip, particularly the incognito or the in private window step, it's not going to work. So absolutely, stick to the video, and you should be able to to get it right now. So um, have a link. Well, there's a link to my YouTube channel below, and it's like the second to last video. It's it's listed right there. It's listed right there. Um, uh, and it's it's called how to get it. How to get the golden toilet. Um, and then come back let me know if you if you've got it or not uh, or if you have problems um, we'll get it sorted we'll get it sorted um, four out of five not too shabby right okay it wasn't an indication where the doors were okay so we could 
It's pretty good, pretty good space. So we could move these to... Let's not move them for now. Leave them where they are for now. Leave them where they are for now. Can we clear this queue just a little bit? Just a smidge. Um, what have we got here? 91? Excellent. They all look good. What's this? 77? No, don't do that. Uh, where are you? You're good. Yeah, okay, there we go. Sorted. Sorted. Getting sorted. Excellent. Oh my god, they even look like they're in the gym jams. That's brilliant. Uh, in the toilet. You're in the toilet. Heading for the queue for ward. Can you go to the top of the queue, please? When you're out of here, when you're done. Excellent. Um, you look like a bumblebee. <laughs> and there's a link in chat. Excellent, well done. Um, is there a time limit on claiming the golden toilet? No. No, there's not. No. No time limit. Get it whenever. Get it whenever. Oh, and Gary answered you. There you go. <laughs> uh, it's great to see a good looking hospital sim again. Yeah. I feel like there hasn't been one in years. Um, in my personal opinion, there hasn't been one since Theme Hospital. <laughs> right. And I've played a few that have come out in the interim. Quite a few. And I've been angry quite a lot. Right. Um, no. Right. Uh, so, what, what was it? Was I, I, I want some training. So, I'm thinking a couple of small training rooms and... No pillaging, please. No pillaging, please. And in the future, I am also... Actually, do you know what? We might move these down here. I am also fairly interested... Um, in research as, as well as well yep so what we're going to do yeah we'll put that there we'll put a couple of desks put a couple of desks in that's going to annoy me let's just uh, I don't know actually yeah no it is it is Right, now look, we've got this encyclopedia bookcase now, plus 2% training speed, and eventually you unlock, I think you unlock it, but you can, I think, also buy it in Kudosh at some point, not sure. But there is an encyclopedia bookcase too, that does plus 4% training speed. Oh my god. <laughs> and they stack. Oh my god. Right, okay. Um, that's enough screaming. So, let's pop some windows in there. Um... Definitely For this want very special edition of Sir Nigel Reviews, right. I visited the Seven Feet Under Funerary Home. I wish to make arrangements for my own eventual demise. And oh. as with everything else, one must try before buying. After being buried for three hours in a variety of coffins, <laughs> what? I finally decided on a lovely worm-resistant oak casket. Greatly recommended. What should I feel about this? There's a lot of people that wouldn't be able to do what he did, I think. Um, the concentration is real, peeps. The concentration is real. Um, that didn't sound good. No. I mean, I do want it, but we don't need it right now, do we? Oh my god, that didn't sound good either. <laughs> people are dying. People are dying out there. This is why we need training. Please look out for invisible and potentially lethal diseases. Please look out for other bullfrog products. Okay. Put that there. And uh, put that there. <laughs> Good. There's the training room. Um, it's a pretty nice one, actually. Gone nuts. Um, and you know what we're going to do? We're going to be another one. Just like it. Over here. <gasps> Look at there. Boom. <laughs> That's a staff room. <laughs> That's a staff room. Stop it. Is it? No. Uh, training room. Toilets. Training room. Let's try again. Let's try it again. The concentration stopped. And look what happened. Nurse, please go to the pharmacy. Yes, please do. Um, let's get a couple of... Oh, no. See, they're going to start staring out the window, aren't they? <laughs> Not gonna have their concentration at all. Let's um, put these back. Oh my 
Oh my god. The stacking. And they're going to be toasty warm. Toasty warm. Oh. Pop. And, um, waste paper. Waste paper basket. It's alright, isn't it? Clock, just so that we know, you know, how long the class has been going on for and whatnot. Should we go into some crazy, crazy detail about training people? Do you want to know? <laughs> just for some crazy detail. Let's go through this mail. Um, plants do need water. Um, yeah, all right. We could, we could train. We could train this person. Okay. Okay, what are we going to train them in? Motivation. So we can see here that it says training units required 240. Um, so this is the beginning of the calculation of how long training is going to take. Okay, and there's lots of things that feed into how long training takes. Okay, the room being one of them, and of course we do have those bookcases and such that uh, boost your training speed, so they'll be taking it into account. How, and this is, this training units required, this is how long this training course uh, will take. So we're now minusing, uh, we've got the speed boost to be taken off for the room. Then we look at our staff member, their learning speed is 165%. So they learn quite quickly and so that will reduce how long it will take for um, this to learn this course even more. So we've got the bookcase, he's a fast learner, fantastic. Then you have to get somebody in to train them. Uh, we're not going to pull anybody off the floor but you can see there they have a training speed of 140%. So again, he could train quite quickly, okay, he could train them quite quickly. The guest training that we're going to get in trains at 180%, 180%, amazing, which means in the end it's only going to take 18 days. Um, so we've managed to bring the training down, I'm not quite sure what it is if everything is on, if everything's just normal, I'm, I'm not sure. We would have to take the bookcases out, find somebody who isn't a fast learner, find somebody who's trains at a normal speed rate can't bother with that um, but it would be much greater I think than 18 days so um, you can fill around with that and get an idea of how much you're improving your room and how much of a boost uh, having a quick learner or a quick trainer can have that's that these things are worth looking at like look at all the little things because there's so much detail there if you know if you want it um, which you know you should shall we also get Look, two janitors in. So we're taking two janitors off the floor. We have to bear that in mind. Um, but they're both going to get motivation training, which will increase their speed and efficiency. It increases their speed by plus 10%. Fantastic. So we will start that training. We will start that training. Um, brilliant. And I think well, I'd like to try and get one of these GPs, I think, in. Um... So we can see here general practice do general practice one. There's nobody ready. Oh no. Doctors. Oh no, look. They both have general practice one and two. So we're looking to get general practice. Do you know we could because we've got a doctor with research here, what we could do is start training up a new GP to take over from this person and they can end up doing a lot of research. Oh my goodness, how did that happen? We just got one star. Fantastic! Thank you, Tarquin, uh, Tarquin Foxbridge. Um, we've unlocked Flemington and the small radiator. Fantastic! Now, I would quite like to move on to Flemington because I personally have never played it. How do you guys watching feel about that? Would you like me to continue with this particular hospital? Or shall we go and start Flemington from scratch where I would like to spend a bit of time because I have never ever played it so i'd really quite like to go i'm quite happy not adding more friends because i play another game where friends uh can just join the game and i like that others uh other than the ones that play it uh what what's what there's a conversation happening here and i'm not privy to it and i'm not sure how i feel about that <laughs> what what are you guys talking about what are you guys talking about i i must know um the bookcases and every item 
like that stacks they do they all stack okay join the discord and get some friends yes yes um so you may not be bother charmed but there could be lots of people that are watching that if you would like to have uh add some friends to your steam who have two point hospital uh, to have online challenges with and get them on your leaderboards we've got quite a gathering happening in my discord there is a link an invite link below uh, click on that join us um there's a two point chat in there i do two point updates in there um and we also have yes a gaming friends list where you can all share your i uh, IDs on Steam and um, people are doing it in there so if you want uh, people to have online challenges with come and join us in the discord um, and I'll be in there later as well hanging out um, chilling with the peeps um, so what are we doing we, we, we're gonna move on to Flemington are we hi Blala I've been lurking around here for a bit now hello Tilda the wild that's a great name that is a great name that that should be in this game <laughs> um, right should we do it then um and we got the small radiator which I'm, I'm really quite pleased about what we'll do before we move on to flemington i think is have a small break about seven minutes i'll put the break screen on it has a countdown on it um so i promise that i will not come down uh, come back until the countdown has reached zero so you have plenty of time to go to the toilet make a cup of tea get a snack have a sandwich you know have a kit cat <laughs> um get some dr pepper um and then and join me again um and we will we'll do this we'll go to flemington we'll we'll bleed and we'll do it also do the bookcases stack percent wise yes all the things that give percentages every item they stack they absolutely do stack it's amazing i built a massive training room with the biggest library training courses finished within seconds it was mental in fact you can see a picture of it on um uh, the two point uh, wiki tw twitter there's a, a two point wiki twitter i founded that wiki again there's a link below for the wiki and the twitter of it has a picture of that training room because uh, i was pretty proud of it pretty proud of it it was fairly useless i mean you're never going to train that many people at once um, and it took up a massive amount of space but they trained really really super fast right back in a minute go and get a cup of tea everybody and we will be back in just one moment <laughs> 